here's my, here's my philosophy on finishes, is that it doesn't matter how you finish because the ball's already gone. So, so it's just what that athlete is comfortable doing. Like so many people spend time coaching that and it's, I think that we, uh, offensively, we should spend far more time on the approach and your hitter being ready and because that's how they're going to be on time. So um, if, what, what can happen is that if they start their finish too early, then that's really going to affect them slapping. And that is the position of this. And that, the first thing when they're pulling off, and this is, I'm kind of jumping ahead here, but if you have a slapper that's pulling off and running to first base, the first thing you want to look at is what their left foot is doing when they land. So their left foot is probably pointing straight at the pitcher. And if that's the case, then their shoulders are going to be open and their barrel is not going to be on plane of the ball anymore. So take care of that, because that foot's going to change their hips and it's going to change their shoulders. Um, the next thing you want to do is to make sure they take literally three steps towards the pitcher after they hit the ball, because that will help them stay on line. Um, so if, you, if you're practicing on a gym floor or in a dirt, just draw that line. 